this is a music playlist that works for me. It works for me because I tailored it to my preference and it has all the songs that I like. It probably won't work for you. Just the same, you should create a playlist personalized to your class. So now let's enter YouTube. So let's say right now I'm looking for a playlist on famous dictators. So I'll start by looking for a video that's on maybe uh, Benito Mussolini. To start any playlist, you have to first find a video. And I'll select the first video. So now I'll scroll down, select the add to with the plus symbol, and go to create new playlist. And I'll have to title this playlist, let's say Famous Dictators. And I can make this playlist public, unlisted, or private. If I make it public, anybody has a chance to view it. So for now, we'll just make it private. Create. And it's been added to my playlist. And you see the video has already been selected Famous Dictators. So there's one video, let's add another. Let's say now we wanna do um, Joseph Stalin or, all right, let's go with Joseph Stalin. And up top I find, a, so I'll open this one up. The BBC Two to coincide with it. Scroll down. Hit the add to box, and we're also going to add this to which one? Famous Dictators, and now it's been added. Maybe I want to add Napoleon. Type in Napoleon Bonaparte. Pick this one here. Scroll down. Add to Famous Dictators. And now let's just check this playlist through my guide. Open up the YouTube guide. And Famous Dictators is right there at the top. Let's check it out. And we have one, two, three, Benito Mussolini, Joseph Stalin, and Napoleon Bonaparte. So let's go back to the slides presentation. I just wanna say it's important to create your own personalized playlist because each classroom is unique. And I also would like to say Thank you for your time and please watch the next video in the series share a video or a playlist 